right, welcome back to Darren Cowboys. Uh, welcome back to Darren Cowboy. Channel of everything you love. I don't know what I'm singing. Anyways, um, a couple things I want to state right off the bat. No, this is not going to become a Rainbow Six Siege only gameplay channel. No, I'm not going to like become only upload like Rainbow Six Siege and like just in general. I just really like the game Rainbow Six Siege. Like I just really enjoy playing it as you can see. As I'm about to wreck this freaking lobby. Um, I don't know what to call this a commentary or not because it's really just the updates that's what's going on in my life right now and uh, not really with my life but what's going to go on with the channel. So everyone's complaining, oh you're changing too much, oh it's like third time you're changing. Man, the game, like I gotta find my flow, I gotta find what matches with me, you know, what resonates. Um, so I've been playing Rainbow Six Siege like non-stop recently, uh, even if I already have Black Ops 3 and I plan on doing a video on that later but I just... I find Rainbow Six Siege much more entertaining because you gotta think about everything you do, you gotta like plan things out, you can't just run and gun like Call of Duty could. But um, anyways, back on topic, uh, the reasons for the Rainbow Six Siege banner, the new logo, um, they just look a little more professional, I just like the way it looks, it looks a little more serious. Not serious, in the sense that it's very strict, but in the sense that like I'll take it more seriously, I'm taking what you more seriously you need to keep the as I'm going because as most of you guys will hear me say, you know, I like YouTube something that I do on the side and I'm not taking it very seriously, but I would like to start taking it seriously. Um, so, I don't know, as you can see as I'm in game, I set up my recorder so I wasn't really paying too much attention to what was going on, therefore I am lost, as you can tell. Uh, anyways, uh, it took me all day to find a good game. Well, not all day, but it took me a couple games because I haven't played this game in like two days. And as much as I love it, I've been missing the school. Um, especially with like all the homework I've been getting, even if it is the first week. You know, it's not that easy in my school. Anyways, yeah, I love Rainbow Six Siege just in general. And I, like, I want to play it more often. So you guys will definitely see me playing this game more often you know, on the channel. Um, but it's not the only thing that's going to be on the channel. What's going to be on the channel is a lot more PC. Because not as much Xbox because... Everyone's telling me to go next gen, so and like the only thing that I've read that right. even gets close to next gen is PC. This PC isn't like lackluster or anything, but it isn't like a GTX 1080 Intel Core i7 6950X. That's like my office computer. I'm not going to use that for recording. You know, it's more serious to use. Anyways, um, yeah, I was playing this just chillaxing, you know, thinking like I got the door. I should probably record something because I'm I'm sitting down doing nothing, just playing Rainbow Six Siege. And I should probably record something. And why not Rainbow Six Siege? Something entertaining. And that's when you can ask my cousin. Or oh, also, shout out. And I won't do this very often, so I'm not giving shout outs to specific channels. But um, shout out to my new, my cousin or my my cousin slash best friends channel, which is uh, assisted gaming. Uh, help them up. I help them start it up. As you, because when you go to this channel, you probably see a bunch of like really well done stuff so why don't you guys go check out his channel he has only one video right now but he's trying to get to work on making more videos because he doesn't really have a good setup i'll be honest but he's working on it so give him some time so go check him out if you guys want probably the only shout i'll ever give that comes to mind right now so yeah also um ah, I can't speak. what do you guys want me to play next like you guys want me to play black ops 3 um Try to think of stuff that I can play. Uh, Dead by Daylight, Kevin, my friend Kevin's been telling me to get Dead by Daylight. He says it's a lot of fun. So I'm definitely getting that. Gmod, I worry. Gmod is already in the works, and I just wrecked those guys behind that. <laughs> Ooh, that was that was pro kill. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely getting G. I already have Gmod, and I've been test messing around with the recordings, and I've actually got a really secure, like. Nothing's gonna go wrong recorder, and that's called Overwolf. And now what Overwolf is, it's an overlay, like in-game overlay, and a lot of you guys are like, well, that, that just sucks. Most in-game overlays suck. Like, they're gonna lag your game, drop FPS. If you guys know what I'm talking about, it's gonna make the game slow. No, Overwolf does a really good job of just not lagging your game. I'm recording all this gameplay with Overwolf, and not even the highest settings. This is balanced setting, so... I only drop like a frame or two, and like, not even joking, Fraps will drop you, drop you like 20 frames, 
Bandit cam, 20 or 30 frames even. Four, most recorders will drop standing. most of your frames. Uh, Overwolf does a really good job of not doing that. I've been Gmod, I've recorded, dropped like five frames, like out of my like average frame rate, which is like nothing, because Gmod isn't a hard game to run. Um, this game, specifically this game, I don't know why, it works really well, because I was getting 60 to 58 FPS average. Drop down 55, but that's perfectly playable. Perfectly like the game doesn't lag. Um, it looks great. It doesn't do anything. And when I record and I'm done recording, it automatically saves it to a folder in a compressed kind of style. So like it doesn't take up a lot of memory, but it, it looks great. Um, so I really enjoyed it. it. Also has a as you can see in the game. I'll probably point it out somehow. It has those little. I don't know if you could tell, but on the left side of my screen, I have a little orb. If you were to hover your mouse over that, a little, a little menu will pop up, It'll, and uh, you can install apps and stuff into that menu, and like, basically, access everything you wouldn't be able to access from inside the game. So you could access Spotify, play music in the game really easily, um, record without dropping too many FPS. As you can tell on the top left, you can see the recording, which there is an option to take that off, but I chose not to just so I can show you an example of what this thing is like. Um, Spotify, I can stream to Twitch without dropping FPS and or my internet connection severely. So I can play games online and stream to Twitch at the same time, which is amazing. I must actually start streaming soon. Need to recover so the I look hostage. forward to that as I am looking very much forward to it. I might even stream this weekend. So if you're watching this, make a little time this weekend. Sit down, get some popcorn. I might stream. Um, what else am I going to like, it's just an overall great. Oh yeah, check this out. This has actually really got me mad. It was doing. It was a really good game, and this kind of ruined it for me. Look at this. Yeah, just garbage. Did you guys see this guy just report him? It's just it's stupid. I hate when people do stuff like this. Take down their whole team, and just ruin the game for everyone. It just ruins the fun. Anyways, back to topic. <laughs> um. Gosh, I really bummed me out when that happened. But anyways, it was regardless a great game, as you will tell at this final last uh, defensive round. Uh, I will probably steal everyone's virginities, and that is fine with me, and as long as it is with them, because my team appreciates it. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, I'm streaming this weekend, probably. I won't pro make any promises, as always, but I'm really sure it'll work. Like, it just works perfect. So if you, have, if you don't already have a Twitch account, make one. You know, it's not that hard to make, and... Only takes you, like not a few seconds. It takes like a minute or two. Really easy to make, and it's worth it because I'm not the only streamer out there that you'll probably enjoy. There's many others I enjoy. Um, but yeah, so expect more PC gameplay. Um, enjoy, like expect G mod because everyone's been asking me for that. Uh, I'm trying to think. <laughs> Should have made a list. I'm not as very, I'm not as professional as I sound, and I don't even think I sound professional. Yeah, so here's the here's the, here's the schedule. All right, I'm not gonna make any promises. Need to protect the now, I'm gonna be the down to earth, you guys. I I've said I'm make, trying to make a schedule, and I actually am. That's no lie. But there's just so much random stuff going on right around this time that I can't be like uploading every day or every day I say I am because something can happen. So uh, I won't make any promises, but I definitely, absolutely will start to upload at least once a week. And if I don't. Y'all start giving me shit. Like you have my permission to, and sorry for the the language. I mean, excuse me, but like y'all can start giving me crap. Like, hey, get on YouTube. You you, you promised you would upload something this week. Come on, you you, you, you told us you don't lie. So you just have my permission. Reloading. That doesn't mean be brute, but means you know just tell me like, hey, upload something. Like y'all waiting. Uh, and it also lets me know that you guys enjoy what I upload. I don't think you guys are going to upload enjoy this video as much, if I'm being honest with myself. But uh, if you do enjoy it, let me know, actually, because I really enjoy just, you know, playing games, commentating over them, kicking people's asses like I do. Deploying sensor. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to get a little cocky in this part. Of the I want you guys to pay attention to what I'm doing. I'm away from the objective. I'm trying to, like, kill them as they enter the building. And I actually got really lucky. Also, the, oh man, that sounds so fucking terrifying when you're in game. Um, but yeah, besides that, okay, so. Also, there's so many topics I'm covering in this one video. It's fucking ridiculous. But, um, 
So, another thing is, people have asked me is, what should you use to record? And I always ask, what are you recording specifically? Are you going to record a Gmod, PC, Xbox? And they always tell me, well, I know whatever I can record, you know, I just want to get started. If you have a laptop, um, if like just any laptop in general, if you can get Gmod, get it. If you can get Overwolf, and Overwolf, by the way, just throw, throw this out there, it's completely free. Once again, completely free that is ridiculous it's probably the best recorder that I found it's, it doesn't have as great implementation as bandit cam where you can put face cam built in but you can put that in yourself and it's not that much work once you get used to it. you just gotta learn how but yeah overall it's free and it's beyond believable what it can do when I put the when I put the max possible settings for recording the best details Get right. <laughs> when I put the max possible details, I only dropped 10 frames. And for me, the, yeah, the game started to get kind of noticeably slower. So, And in a game like Rainbow Six, you need to be fast. So I wasn't going to make that trade off. But when I get a better setup, I will definitely max out my recorder. Because that 10 frames is nothing for the kind of quality you guys can get. And this game also is not... I'm not running it at max settings. Um, I'm running it... I think medium to high settings, 2080p, so it's not ultra, but, you know, it still looks great regardless of what settings. Also, check this out. Perfect. Um, so, yeah, uh, that's pretty much all I have to say besides... Oh, yeah, I was about to leave you guys off on a clip. But, yeah, if you have a laptop, no matter what kind of laptop, it can be old, it can be small. If you can get Gmod, what... As long as the laptop isn't like from 1998, if it's a laptop that's 2010 and above, and you're absolutely sure, get Gmod, get Overwolf, and you can literally start recording the same exact day. And now, I can't promise you'll get super popular right away. I, I mean, I only have like 48, I believe, subs or subscribers. Sorry for the sub language. But yeah, so I uh, hope you guys enjoy. Uh, good luck out there if you guys do listen to my advice, and I'll see you guys later.